Good morning, Stephanie Kemmerman, the Stock Whisperer, here to tell you the whisper of the day. But before we get to today's whisper, that's right, we got to talk about Friday's whisper. So Friday, we were watching Facebook. We had a pretty big print at 179.33. We were only bullish above 180. Really key level of resistance. If it was smart money buying, we should have broken right through it. And you can see we could not do that. So therefore... Uh, still bearish. It looks like we're testing that print. That's a pretty common pattern. Uh, I would be bearish below 179 today. And again, if we did break above 180, then I would turn bullish. Um, also, Apple. Key level that we were watching uh, on the prints were 171.53. Uh, we were bearish below 171. And this was a fantastic trade on the short side for Apple. Halliburton, we also had a big print at uh, $41.60. We are above the print, but bullish above 42. Really still want to see Halliburton break above 42, so continue to watch that level. Abercrombie was a big winner for uh, so many of my traders on Friday. Uh, we were bearish below 14.80 and bullish above 15.15. You can see had a nice pop there. I know Susie had a nice trade on that, but the trader of the day goes to Blanca. Blanca has been consistently rocking it in the pit. Uh, fantastic entry on the Bitcoin Blanca. So yeah, we trade everything, stocks, options, Forex, futures, and Bitcoin. Um, and so uh, excellent trading Blanca. All right, so what are we watching today? We had really big interesting prints coming on Friday. Let me just go over H&R Block first. This was a fantastic trade uh, for myself and a lot of my traders. Uh, back in May, we had prints and seasonality, and guess what? We had the same exact thing again. I'm so excited about this. Uh, we had a big million share print that came in on Friday at $25.97. So I'm going to be bullish, uh, obviously above the print, but $26.20. I'd like to see a close above that, and uh, of course with each level, that would be even more bullish. Check out the weekly chart as well looks amazing we are above that uh, 50 simple moving average a lot of volume came in last week so yeah this looks like it could be the beginning of a bigger move so watch h and r block also intel massive massive prints a lot of them at 45 dollars and six cents to 45 dollars and 13 cents so only going to be bullish above 45 25 and uh, we're going to be bearish below 45. So keep your eye on this one. There is a nice gap in the chart. Popular pattern is right to the gap. And then it usually takes a move up. So that would be my target on the short side. Uh, let's definitely watch General Motors. Love General Motors. We had beautiful prints on Thursday. 860,000 shares at 43.14. 200,000 at 43. Love this above 44, but you know, check out this weekly chart. Looks like it has a nice J hook on a really good print volume. So I love General Motors as a swing, as long as it can stay above uh, the prints, especially, but 44 is the key level. So come out to trade these stocks and so many more all day long. Just want to let you know I will not be in tomorrow. Uh, it's Thanksgiving, and I will be flying out to see family. So happy Thanksgiving, everybody, and happy trading.